Well, hello there. Um, I know there, there's probably going to be a lot of guys coming over to the Philippines from different countries now that it's open. And I want to do a short video on some stuff you might want to bring with you. Ah, here's the bike. Uh, Rusi, I bought it in 2017. It now has 11,500 kilometers on it. Now, I did buy these uh, gloves in California. This is, uh, if you can see on there, it says 2XL. So, I think you can buy gloves like this in the Philippines, but if you have big hands, you might want to buy something like this. These are, I don't remember how much I paid for them, but these are leather. And if you're going to ride a bike. And I bought these goggles a long time ago in Van Nuys. Uh, I can't remember what I paid for them, but the name, brand name is Bobster. I don't know. Yeah. But I bought these like 2007. I did buy the, um, the helmet here in the Philippines, it's a zebra. I bought this like 2015 and it's a real helmet. I don't know if it's certified. It does have some kind of certification on the back. I, pay, I bought this at Unitop for about, oh, I guess uh, 800 pesos, something like that. And it has like vents here that goes, air flows through inside the helmet. It's Chinese, it's probably Chinese, but if you want a, a real helmet, you know, a certified helmet, you might want to bring one from your home country. Now, there's something else here. Now, it's going to rain a lot, so about 2015, when I first came here, I bought this jacket here, a rain jacket. It's a, it's Patagonia. I bought it in Old Town, Old Town, Pasadena, and it's like I guess you could say that it's kind of like um, top of the line. And I've worn it a lot, but unfortunately, um, then I don't know about now, but they didn't sell rain pants at Patagonia, so I bought. Uh, rain pants here and the brand name is uh, co-op co-op cycles and I bought this at REI but with this setup I've ridden in pouring rain and I didn't get wet they had the rain pants and you can see this is uh, a Patagonia brand this is excellent. Uh, I don't remember what I paid for, but if you want, if you think that you're gonna be in the rain, or, and you probably will, in the Philippines, or riding a, a bike in the rain, then uh, you might want to invest in some good uh, rain wear. I think if you went to, uh, like Global City, you might be able to find something like this. You know, a rain jacket and rain pants. But just like in Dumaguete or around here, then uh, you're probably going to have to bring something with you. And if you got big hands, you probably want to bring some motorcycle gloves with you. If you want to wear gloves. Um, so the bike is in still in good shape. Um, uh, ride it pretty much every day. This is my transportation. It's pretty dirty right now, but it has done pretty good. I mean, I bought it in November 2017. I've done a few videos on different repairs that I've done uh, or, or had done. If you have any repairs with Rusi, then Rusi pays, uh, I mean, Rusi doesn't charge you for labor. Only the parts. Anyway, I think that's it. Just like a brief video on some motorcycle gear and rain jacket and rain pants 
and you should be good to go if uh, if you're going to be riding a scooter or a motorcycle when you come here and chances are you will so it's good to get uh, get your gear together before you come here and that's about it ah, rear tail light burned out uh, I got a new one 50 pesos looks like I got the, the last one